Hello my pants are gang, welcome back to your new video. So this is basically the Psychic Tarot Oracle reading, so it's the tarot cards and the oracles um, mixed together. Um, just a disclaimer that all cross watchers, you're more than welcome to take whatever resonates with yourselves and you can just check out this video, that's not a problem. Um, so yeah, what I've done is a couple of cards for you to see what's in store and there is things linked into the tarot and the oracles as well. So I'm going to first start off with the first card which is all about power and this shows you, you know, a, a, a man and a lion. So basically this is like a Leo sign for some people, there may be a Leo person coming in. But in general this is about power, is having that bravery, is having that strength, is having that willpower to move forward. And actually go ahead and do something so there's a lot of um, strength that's coming forward for you very soon you then have the positive movement forward card so basically you're going to go into calm waters after a certain situation um, or some type of obstacles that you've been going through it they're all going to die down and everything's going to be very calm. So you're going into calm waters, you're going into the sunset um, where everything feels perfect and fine and happy um, and you find joy in that and feel like it is a very, very positive thing for you to do. You then have the next card then which is Passion Ignited. So there is something that's going to be set alight inside you which is going to make you feel like everything's going to be perfect everything's going to be fine this is going to make me the best person i am um there is something that's going to be of success and there is maybe some type of love offer that's coming forward for you and this is making you feel more loved in yourself and feel loved as well there is a lot of passion that you are going to be um having the overcome by you then have the next card which is deception and envy so it is going to be some type of thing that's going on that is involved with deception and some type of envy so you may go into some type of deception over a person or over a certain situation and then it may be you or someone else then could be envying one or the other some of you have got to do with a business opportunity some job offer that there is some type of envy over um and it was supposed to be someone else's job like it's supposed to be yours but someone else have took that offer someone took the promotion that's why i got for someone that's watching this video But for some of you then, it is that type of sense that is this the right option to do in a certain situation? So maybe you've took up an offer um, and it's supposed to be in someone else's and you don't know whether to do it, but you're actually feeling that envy for someone. You then have the card of memories of love. So there may be um, a past lover that you may be thinking about. Um, or you're going to be coming in contact with a past lover um, or you're thinking about all the memories that you had with this person all the love you had or everything that cherished you the most um, there is that sense of for some of you it could be linked to family you know feeling the love that you have for your family um, or someone that's passing over when you see this reading maybe a loved one that's literally just passed over and you having that thought process about all the love all the memories that you had with this person um and you're just thinking about all the happiness all the memories but yet it's still that bit of sorrow that's going to be sticking with you and that sadness you then have the base chakra card so the base chakra card is all to do with you know the base of your spine and it's all to do with um, needs of physical body issues, issues of money, sustenance, safety and shelter. Um, basically what you need to be doing is either having a dance or doing some good exercise to um, activate the chakra so it's not too imbalanced. Um, but if you keep having that harmonious flowing energy 
dancing and exercising and feeling free, then what you've been taking inside, you're going to be honouring it on the outside. So it's going to basically both work the same. By loving your outside, you'll be loving your inside as well. So doing all this exercises and activities and things like that, it is going to help quite a lot for you. You then have the card of conflict and defeat. So there is some type of conflict that's coming up that's going to be arising. There is a lot of feeling down, depressed and not what to do. Don't know what, where to turn, don't know who to turn to. There is that feeling of being left alone. Um, and for some of you, entrapment I'm getting as well that could be involved in this conflict. It's someone that is literally breaking you apart and you just don't know where to turn. You know, it's like an outbreaking situation that's going to be happening and defeat is also in there as well. So you may have that type of feeling of needing to defend your position. You then have the authority figure card. So you may be taking charge in a situation or you are going to see some type of authority figure um, very, very soon. So someone that you look up to, someone you're going to get some type of advice from, that someone that's a very, very um, authoritative that you are going to be coming in contact with. Um, that this could be yourself, you know, taking charge over a certain situation. And there is going to be some triumph over a certain situation. There is going to be success. There is going to be that feel of, you know, like a, <sighs> everything's done and dusted. I can, you know, I can breathe tidy. I can be me. And don't have to worry but there is that type of spiritual union coming involved so this is like a karmic nature um so it's all to do with things that's not on the physical but things on the spiritual side so this is what was meant to happen basically you and this person is very very connected wherever it is um they may be coming in with a love offer they may be coming in with some type of friendship offer you then have the card of transformation so you're going to be transforming um in all different kinds of ways in in feeling different in feeling happy you know not no restrictions that's going to be um overwhelming you there is that type of you know feeling free and basically like when a butterfly comes from a cocoon you know it's that type of transformation. Is it going to be something that you're going to be transforming in your own body? Then you have the last card there, which is suffering in silence. So there may be some type of suffering that you are going to be going um, going through. It could be loss of a loved one um, or some mental conflict. A lot of things that is deep down inside you and you can't speak to anyone or you've had an argument with someone and you're just keeping suffering in silence. Um, but it could be that type of feeling that you haven't got anyone for support in a certain situation and you need that support because you're suffering so much inside that you want the pain to go away and it's not going away because you're keeping it trapped inside you and you need to open up and tell someone about it. Okay then, so that's your reading. Please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell if you enjoy my videos. Stay positive and stay safe and i see you again soon. Bye.